Are you a person of interest? Jim Rohn said, To attract other people, we must become attractive. This is especially important in this age of information, rapid change, and in-your-face distraction. People are bombarded with a steady stream of stimuli overwhelming their senses and overloading their brain 24-7. The average human attention span rivals that of a goldfish at less than 8 seconds. To succeed in any venture that involves other people, it is imperative that we know how to arouse interest and get noticed. The good news is we have more opportunities readily available to us today than in any other time in history. The Internet has become the great equalizer, leveling the playing field so that anyone can be discovered at any time and from any place in the world. Social media provides a 24-hour platform with global reach, giving anyone with an Internet connection access to 8 billion people. And AI technology empowers us to automate processes, save time and money, and complete certain tasks and projects efficiently without having to learn the skills and or acquire the specialized knowledge that was necessary to master those tasks up until recently. That being said, even the most talented, skilled individual cannot leverage their gifts and monetize their skills without recognition by people that value that individual's products or services. We all have unique gifts that can benefit and add value to the lives of others. However, to share those gifts and serve others, people must know we exist. We must become skilled in the art of attraction. Here are three helpful tips for becoming a person of interest and attracting your tribe. 1. Add value to people's lives. Wake up each morning with an attitude of how can I serve people and solve their problems today. Remember, money is simply a tool. It represents a transfer of energy. Money is exchanged when problems are solved. The more difficult the problem, the more value assigned to the solution, the more money you receive for solving it. 2. Decide who you want to attract and devise a plan to connect and build rapport with this audience. Get to know their pain points and desires. Show you care by listening attentively. Then ask clarifying questions to show interest and reflect understanding. Practice empathy by putting yourself in the other person's shoes. 3. Be consistent. You will lose trust with people if you only show up when you want to. Consistency builds trust and lets others know you are reliable and can be counted on. What strategies have you used successfully to get noticed online? Let's end with a quote by Coach Michael Burt, whose blog post inspired me to write this one. Success is not an accident. It is a deliberate choice backed by relentless action and unwavering commitment.